Aries, how are you doing? Welcome to Salami Tarot. I hope all is well. What's the vibes of the Aries at this time? Like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for those that are liking what are the vibes here. I'm confused what I should do. They don't know what to do, Aries. I'm confused about what I should do about my feelings for you. I'm battling between my heart and my mind. Aries, Sun, Moon, Venus signs. This is your message at this time. Someone here doesn't really know what to do. They're battling. They're going back and forth. And this could be you, Aries. You're like, what should I do? Silavi says nothing. Okay. Um, I feel like there's someone here that's confused. Now, how I feel about people that are confused. Hmm. Let them figure it out, right? I mean, someone here is saying that they're confused. I, I, now, if this is Aries that's confused, the question is, what are you confused about? That's where the personal reading comes in, right? Of course. But I'm confused what I should do about my feelings for you. I'm battling between my heart and my mind. Let's get some more. You guys know the vibes already. Like, if you're confused... I can't help you, bro. All right. So what else do we have here? I'm sorry for judging you, Aries, hurting your feelings. I wouldn't know the pain you're going through. Someone here is like, maybe they could be a bit like cold. I really hope this is not a Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, Scorpio, Leo. There's someone here that's saying like, I, I can't figure out what you're going through. I really don't get it. I don't get it. Like maybe you've tried to express yourself to me, but I still can't register it. I can't still I can't figure out what you're going through, Aries. Someone here is not understanding where you're coming from. But I'll tell you one thing. Someone here is definitely understanding that they have a connection with you. That I understand. I understand I have a connection with you. I understand that I still feel you. I understand that we're still one. This person could be initials. V O B M E J or or a D. Okay? Or even an A. I don't know if I said that already. But either way here, someone is saying like maybe I should send you a message. Maybe I shouldn't send you a message here. I know if I say the wrong thing, it's not going to make sense to, to you or it's not going to make sense to me here. So there could be an energy of like someone here noticing that you're focusing on your business. We have a very focused energy. This is definitely Aries at this time. Some of you are like, I'm focusing on my money. So I'll be terror. I don't know what you're talking about. Some of you are definitely focusing on money, focusing on building, building for your next chapter in life. Right, it says I'm focusing on my business and progress in life. To put any energy into this connection at this time is just frustrating. So there's someone here that's frustrated with this. I'm a bit tired of this. I got a lot of things happening at work. I'm trying to create structure. I'm trying to create balance. And here you go. Here. Okay. So let's dig a little bit more Aries and see what's going on. Again, remember, this is a general reading. If you want a personal reading, that's below salavitero.com. All right. How is this person feeling about Aries at this time? I'm sorry for judging you. Is someone here judging you about what you look like or your, your surroundings? Or this person's judging you because maybe something happened and they don't want to get over it? Or this person's always thinking that, you know, maybe your zodiac sign's not compatible. Maybe this person's into zodiac signs. If not, this person's always viewing you as someone that I hope I hope this person's not viewing you as somebody that's judging them. Maybe this person feels judged by you. How is this person feeling about Aries? They're fighting it. <sighs> Aries. You know, I do love a good Aries in my life. Someone here is saying, <laughs> someone here is saying, like, I am fighting that urge. I'm fighting that feeling. This person feels like they become one in your presence here. Is this another fire sign? Maybe Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, or even a, I feel like it could be a strong mm, Capricorn. 
I get Capricorn energy. I get Libra too. Someone here could have realized you posted something and they want to say something back to you, but they don't know what to say, how to say it. Aries, I feel like you're at a point where you're saying, I'm not fighting anything anymore. I'm not fighting to be a part of anybody's life anymore. I'm fighting to pay these bills. <laughs> okay. Um, I get this one-sided energy. I don't know if that's just my eyes. That was, that was literally just my eyes. I literally felt like there's one person fighting here only. Aries, have you stepped away and gave up? Some of you have gave, given up or maybe this person's viewing you as given up here. Someone here is saying like, I am, um, I am above this. I am, I am better than this. I don't need this. It says the harder I try to resist you, the weaker I seem to be. So Aries, there could be a lot of attention that you're getting this month. You get this attention by focusing on yourself though. And you know, what's so interesting about the Aries energy is that you know, throughout this journey, Aries, you always learn about who you are. So the best question, the best question, and you know, whether, whether you hear anything else that I say tonight or today is how does this person make me feel? If you always ask yourself, how does this person make me feel? And you wait for the answer. Everybody's going to have a different answer. How does this person make me feel with their actions right now? Not what they used to do, not what they did in 1914, what they're making me feel right now. And if it's loyalty, consistency, love, all that good jazz, then we're good. But it's, if it's anything else, then there's another conversation. But Aries is in a place where they're sitting back and they're focusing on themselves. And it could be on your work, whatever it is that you're focusing on, maybe your family, whatever. But I feel like the biggest question, whoever it is that you're connecting with, Aries, how does this person make me feel when I connect with them? Maybe they empower you, right? Maybe this person makes you feel good and you could be in the position of like, I'm fighting it because I messed up. Some of my Aries definitely messed up, all right? I did or said the wrong thing. We have fantasizing here. We have fantasizing. I've been fantasizing about you. And we have true love here. And we also have silent moves, Aries. We have strong silent moves here. But because this person's wearing those beautiful glasses, okay, um, I feel like this is someone here that's saying, like, I'm moving in silent. This could be someone that's very secretive. Very, very secretive. And it's interesting because I feel like someone doesn't understand that Aries has a plan as well. I have a plan for you as well, right? Just as much as you want to be silent, I have a plan for you. Okay, whatever that plan may look like for Aries, right? But there's an energy of someone here moving silently. Maybe someone here is not responding to someone's call. Maybe someone here plans on rejecting someone's next text message. Like next time they text me, say, lovey, Taro, I'm not responding to this person. Or the next time this person tries to make me jealous, I'm not responding to that vibe. I'm not playing this person's game here. Let's get a little bit more. I'm not playing this person's game. Freedom. Yeah freedom what does this say here it says i want i want the freedom to pursue my own happiness at this time so again this could be someone here that's seeking their freedom take it how it resonates someone here is saying like i want to be free i don't want any attachments here and that's the truth there could be an energy of so love you tara i really like this person but i do like my freedom i do feel like aries is going on a trip okay um Maybe you're going on a trip. Maybe you're going to connect with family overseas or maybe you're going into a different state or maybe you're driving somewhere. Check your car, of course. Check your spending, Spirit says. Get some sleep, of course. But Spirit is saying someone here wants their freedom. The first thing I heard is let them be. Let them be and stay silent. There's something about being silent here. Something about not reacting all the time, Aries. And I'm not saying every Aries it reacts. That's not what I'm saying. But there's like this message of learning how to not react. 
And what I mean by that is sometimes not reacting with your facial expressions, not reacting with your physical. And even when you're at work or when you're around people, you're just calm, cool, collective, right? You're moving like a Scorpio or you're moving like whoever, all right? I don't want to really put signs in there, but you're moving like someone here that's undetectable, unpredictable, all right? And I feel like some of you are mastering that energy like... I'm unpredictable. Unpredictable Aries. Hmm. Have I ever met that before? All right. So let's see what we have here. Let's get a little bit more. Aries, I'm telling you right now, somebody that you're connecting with, they want to be free. They want space. Give them the universe. They want space. Give them the universe. It's so funny because this person wants space, but they're still thinking about you. Make that mm -hmm, make sense. All right. Let's get a little bit more. Overall energy here for Aries before I go. Like, share, and subscribe, Aries. Got away. This person's going to feel like you got away, and it is going to bother the heck out of someone. Someone's going to send you a GIF, Aries, a token of affection, a text message, an embrace, a cuddle. Someone is saying, I want to cuddle with you. I want to feel close with you again. What? And someone is saying that at the end of the day, we're always going to be friends. Some of you feel like this person put you in a friend zone here, but deep down inside, you feel like this person is your soulmate. I will talk to you soon, Aries. I love you. I hope this was influential to some degree. And again, if you're interested in a personal reading, I'll talk to you soon. Have a good one.